What's up guys, it's JTB Gaming here, and today we have the first episode of the new Salford City career mode, in which I'll be taking EFL League 2 side Salford City, hopefully to Premier League glory. Starting off the season, I'll be lining up the team in a 4-4-2. We'll have Lutheran in goal, Baldwin and Burgess at center backs, Tanner at right back, Torre at left back, Gibson and Towel at center mids, Andrade at right mid, Hunter at left mid, with Wilson and Elliott at strikers. We have sold our first player, and that is going to be Scott Wiseman, who will be joining Adox Italiano for $115,000. Nathan Pond will also be departing the club, as he will be joining TSV Hartberg in Austria for $80,000. The first player that we have signed is Craig McGilvray. He was bought for $1.45 million. He is a 69 overall goalkeeper. I will look to have him as our starter for this season and hopefully next season as well. The second player that we have bought is Eric Matohoho. He is a center back from South Africa. We bought him for $2.3 million as he will look to be, along with McGalvray, our cent one of our key players for this year and hopefully next season as well. With the remaining cash, I have decided to buy a youth scout and he will be a four-star, three-star scout and I have decided to send him to England for the next three months to find some physically strong players. With the arrival of McGilvray, I have decided to sell Chris Neal to Crawley Town for $150,000 and now into the first game of the season. Hi everybody, a lovely day for football here. Welcome to you. I'm Mark on the lineup for the home team. Probably one of the two front men will slip behind the other and, and augment the midfield when required. I think so. If they start getting overloaded in the middle of the park, that's always an option for this manager who does like to fill his midfield. Responsibility for some of those five in midfield to get forward. And uh, I'm sure the, the main striker won't be isolated, although it looks a bit like that on our screens. Yeah, he could be a lonely man up top there if he doesn't get the support that uh, he needs because signal from the referee and off we go to Gibson Hunter that's fair play, he's got his body in there and he can protect the ball. It'll be a throw, no nonsense clearance from the defender. Tanner, he's won it back easily. Chance to go at the opposition with pace. Threading it through. Going forward well. Well, the promise was great in that counter-attack, but there were no fruits for the considerable amount of labour that was put in to getting the ball up the pitch. Yeah, goodness me. Got a bit overexcited there, didn't he, trying to finish that? Well, he's looked the manager at what they need in the transfer market and he's decided that a strong central defender is what's required and here he is making his debut. Yeah, probing with the pass. Cleared the ball. Hunter. Chance to put it in the box from here. And the referee spotted that deflection, he's pointed for the corner. What about that chance? A few minutes ago we can see it again now well I'm guessing that he's not going to try that again in a hurry particularly after his manager gets into him after this match corner swung in he's got that well out of harm's way To the other flank. They could go in front here.
In goes the corner. He's gone for the punch, it's a good one. Well, he's better than that. It's a poor pass. Well, I think they can nick it from him, but I don't think they can. It's just a bit lax in possession. Elliot. Can go in from here. Out in front of goal. No real challenge to the defender from that cross. Not a very active way of playing this for the defending team because they're not going out and closing the opposition. They're just saying, well, you can have the ball. We'll cope with it. But it does invite the sort of pressure you can crack under. Real chance. Decent try. It was, but he had uh, two or three players in the box screaming for the ball. Very good physicality from him to shield the ball. With his skill, here's a chance to have a run at goal and take the opposition on. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? It's what we all want to see, the referee's playing advantage, he's done it well here. A chance to break away now on the counter. Could have done better with that counter-attack. Gibson. Game still level. Can't hang onto it, the keeper. Well, here it is. The first goal of the game that they have absolutely dominated. Very good play. Defence opened up again, but the difference is this time that they put the ball past the goalkeeper. Good finish. And they're looking a very classy side at the moment. Oh, that's good anticipation. He expected the keeper to carry that, and that's exactly what happened. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Goal for the hosts, number 11, Tom Elliott. Now a chance to get a bit of width into this attack. And it's out of play. Chance to get the ball in the box. Trying too hard, hitting the ball too hard. And it's way out for a throw. Tanner. Tanner. Sliding in, bit rash, got away with it. Well, not surprisingly, the fans pretty angry with that decision. They were Sure, that was a penalty. Trying to find an opening on this counter-attack. Well, that counter-attack didn't work, and they might be counter-attacked themselves now. Well, they could have been opened up there. But the interception stopped that. The assistant has raised the flag for offside. Newton. He's given it away. Great interception. It's gone out for a throw.
could whip it in from here. Good deep cross towards the far post. And now they've got a corner on the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal. Put the corner in the middle. Punched away by the keeper. Proper clearance. Well away from the danger zone. And he's back heeled it nicely to a supporting player. Tanner. Aim for those in the middle. Corner given. Corner played into the middle. There's still danger here after this half clearance. Well, he has cleared the danger. Given that he tried to place it, he got it rather wrong. Yeah, probably did choose the option, should have tried to get some power behind that shot. Well, the action is going to continue here. We've got four minutes of added time. Well, they're sitting off the opposition here, and that can invite pressure. With great vision here. Got to be. Fantastic save. And in it goes. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Well, that's all they can do at the moment, concede the corners. Swung in from the corner. Only partially away from danger. Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. And that's half-time. Signaled by the referee. 1-0 the half-time score. It's been tight, it's been tense, it's been terrific, really. Well, it has. You can't take your eyes off it, although there's not been a feast of goals. It's been one of those matches where you never quite know what's going to happen next. has blown and the second half is now in progress trying to spot a potential ball to open them up but they're keeping the ball well now Elliot and it's Wilson great ball Can really get at the opposition here Open them up here. Oh, that's a penalty. More trouble. Well, this might just be the nail in the coffin. Two decisions for the referee here. Was it a penalty? He says yes. What colour card? He said yellow. Yeah, you can't really argue. And what a chance this is from 12 yards. He scored from the spot. Without turning a hair, he made it look easy. Well, he's got a certain technique with these penalties. Goalkeepers find it difficult to cope.
starting at 2-0. So Real Madrid, who have got some money to spend, they have spent it on this fellow. And he is a good player. He's uh, got plenty of excellent years ahead of him in my book. So uh, that £65 million, pounds, that ballpark figure, I think uh, they won't live to regret it. Substitute coming up for the away team. Clever idea with the through ball. The defender saw it coming. That's cut out. Kennedy, that's a good challenge. Tanner, played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. The hosts have controlled possession here so far. The way they've played, the way they've been clinical in front of goal, it's difficult to see a way back for the opposition if they can continue in this vein. They've been so good out here today. Well, long overdue, you feel, this change. The side that's behind, a switch of tactics now. Put the corner in the middle. It's a fine stop, a full stretch from the keeper to turn that aside. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes, half an hour to go. And Kennedy. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Newton. This is a good opportunity to put the ball. It's still dangerous here off the goalkeeper. And it's played to Elliott. Baldwin. To Gibson. Gibson. It's good play, this. The opposition can't get at them when they're keeping the ball. The the to Gibson, the working the ball around, working the opposition around. JKK, please contact your nearest security guard. Thank you. He wants to shoot, you can see that. He's got good support in the middle if he gets his cross in. Should be. To go in from here. That pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Wonderful chance! Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. He took it with greater plum, I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. Let's have another peek at that goal. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. Well, they're going to shuffle the back a bit now. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Coming off the pitch. Number 18, Dean Parrott, to be replaced by number 6, Tom Sauls. And they've spread it out wide here, taking on a couple of opponents now. Baldwin. Hunter. Tight scenario here on the ball. Gibson. Well, they could get the ball back here, and they have done. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Newton. Goes for goal! 
threw everything behind that shot and frustrated that it wasn't quite on target. Well, if he keeps getting in those kind of areas, I'm sure he'll score pretty soon. We've got 10 minutes left on the clock. Gibson. Great interception. Jackson. Now he can cross it. Striding forward purposefully. Read the play well to intercept. Got the ball, and they're going at the opposition with speed. Well, that counter-attack didn't work, and they might be counter attack themselves now. One to chase down. It's gone over the defenders. To Gibson. Crafting the through pass. Shots on here. Ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Made a quick interception. Bit of a desperate lunge, that. And he's going to get booked for it, I think. Well, that episode is going to lead to a yellow card from the referee. Well, look at the ref. He reached for his pocket straight away. No uh, hesitation from him. Well, you run the risk when you go to ground like that with a slide tackle of getting into serious trouble. Well, it is. He saw the ball and he thought he could win it, but just a fraction off. Taken short. Could really get at the opposition here. Keeper controls it, never looked like bouncing off him. It made it look easy, but his positioning did that for him. And it's Wilson. Good vision, played over the back of the defenders. The defender really putting his body on the line to stop the cross. It's finished now with the final whistle. Great start, just what you want, first game of the season, first win. Yep, I'll be delighted, put a lot of work into that, put the rewards. Well, undoubtedly, he was the star man today. So often we think of his creative abilities, that knack of picking out a pass, but today it was all about his finishing. Really good couple of goals in this team win.